Does the team have confidence they can win them all when you struggle as much as you have the last couple of years? I mean, this is a new team. I think every every year is a new year. We're, we're undefeated right now. That's what we're going for. We're going to shoot to win them all, and I, I don't see why why we shouldn't. What? Um, how, what, how, many can, how many reps are you getting behind Ian? I mean, how's that all working? What are you anticipating when games start in terms of playing time? Yeah, I, whatever uh, Coach Elston puts out there. I mean, I got full faith in him and everything. And, um, you know, I'm just playing every play of uh, practice, just trying to get better and, you know, just trying to fight for every bit of playing time I could get. Is it safe to say that you're in the best shape of your life after what you've gone through in the summer? And Absolutely, yes. <laughs> Coach Longa really knows how to condition yeah. us. And uh, going through these practices, they're, they're uh, something different. And I think they're great. What sets Coach Longo's plan apart? Um, I think we, everyone just bought in and, you know, he's, you just trust in Coach Longo. He's a great guy and, uh, you know, I, I just think he works us real hard and we got full faith in him and we're buying in on and off the field and we're just make, trying to make good decisions. Thanks, Sean. Thank you. Sean, they've been, uh, we were just talking to Coach Elston and he said you basically you can play all three positions. Have you been practicing in all three positions so far? I mean, I'm just playing whatever Coach Elston tells me to play, so I'm, I'm really just doing uh, whatever he wants, just working on technique and trying to get better every day. And, you know, every time I'm out there, no matter where I'm at, I'm just going to be giving it my all, just trying to get on the field and do whatever I can to help the team win. Do you feel any more comfortable at one of the position versus the others? Oh, I mean, I played nose last year, so, I mean, I, I feel comfortable right there. But, I mean, I, whatever Coach Elson wants us to do, I'll, I'll do. One thing in talking to Taylor, he said with this faster-paced offense and the spread, the benefit is kind of tiring out the D-line and seeing you guys' hands on your knees a little bit. Do you feel that, you know, it's been more beneficial for you guys or him? Um, it's definitely beneficial for us. I mean, we're used to going hard uh, against them, and they're moving so fast that, uh, you know, we got to get back and get the call and, and get down and get ready to play. And, you know, it's just going to be uh, – it's, it's really good conditioning, and I think it's going to be great when, we, when the game rolls around and, you know, we're not going against that fast pace every time. We're going to – be, uh, we're going to be ready to go because we're going to be conditioned from going against this offense. Some of these first year players, I guess you could say, on the team, they tend to they kind of stick out pretty mm -hmm. early as far as I'm trying to catch on how much of a role they've had in trying to kind of mentor them and get them up to speed a little bit. Uh, whenever they, you know, whenever they need something, uh, I'll help them out. And, you know, at, whatever, they have to learn the playbook. I mean, I have it down pretty much from the spring. So, you know, I'll help them out here and there, just telling them, you know, some technique stuff and everything's you new. Know, I remember going through, uh, you know, freshman year. It's tough, but I'm just trying to help them as much as I can. I'm not whole. I'm not whole. Thanks.